I met someone in Metro today. He said, sir, what is this controversy about Jan Lokpal? I'm utterly confused. You launched a movement on Jan Lokpal. The party won election and they're now bringing Jan Lokpal. So what is the controversy? And he said, why are you people obstructing it? Like all opposition parties, if there are some minor issues, just let it be, let Jan Lokpal come. Why this great controversy? Do you feel like this? If you do, just stay with me for two or three minutes. This video is meant for you. Because that's actually the way I also thought. When Aam Aadmi Party government came, I thought this is one of the easiest things for them to do. Because last year, when there was a 49-day government of Aam Aadmi Party, there already was a bill. Everything was prepared. You remember? The bill about which Arvind Kejriwal had said, this is so sacred to me that I would rather give up my chief ministership than give up the bill. So I thought he would come to, now that they are in power, Aam Aadmi Party would pick up that bill, get it passed. Months passed, the bill was not presented. I was a little unsure. Then there was this great mystery and secrecy. We will not tell what the bill is about. I got a little suspicious and started keeping an eye. When the bill came out, we requested Prashanji to take a look. He compared it very systematically. So he came up with a very detailed table. This is on what the provisions were in Rambila Maidan. Because in Rambila Maidan, we actually gave a complete detailed brief of what the law would be like, what should Jan Lokpal be. Then on each of those things, what was the bill proposed by Congress party which we rejected? What was the bill proposed by Aam Aadmi party in its 49-day government? And what is the current bill? So we compared it provision by provision, clause by clause, every detailed thing we went into. At the end of it, we were shocked. We were shocked because this bill is not at all the bill that was agreed upon in Rambila Maidan and this is not at all the bill that was presented last year. The only thing common about these two is the name Jan Lokpal. Everything else has been changed. We demanded in Ramlila Maidan that Lokpal should be appointed by a body where the majority is not with politicians. Last year's act said there would be Five people who would be non-politicians, only two would be politicians. This time it's been changed and three out of four are politicians. We demanded that Lokpal cannot be removed except by judges. This is the provision of last year's bill. And this year the government is saying that two-third MLAs can remove the Lokpal. So just imagine Jitendra Tomar and Somnath Bharti getting up and saying, please remove this Lokpal. By two-thirds majority, the party can remove any time. The third demand was that Lokpal should have independent investigative agency of its own. That was provided for in the last year's bill. Has been removed this time. About the jurisdiction, Last year's bill clearly said this would apply to all the officials of Delhi government, people who have come on deputation on Delhi government, and will even apply on DDA persons, on Delhi police, on MCD. Perfect. This year, there's no mention of any of those things. Last year, it mentioned CM and ministers by name. There's no such mention this year. This year's bill says any corruption that takes place in the territory of Delhi which is to say, if a minister and officer of Delhi government goes to Noida and Gurgaon and get, accepts bribe there, he's not covered under this act. And in any case, this act would cover all the central government employees and ministers working in Delhi. How can anyone accept that? So this is a perfect recipe to prevent this bill from coming into existence. We are not opposing this bill because we have any personal problem with it. We are not bringing any of our considerations into this. All we are saying is something very, very simple. We are simply saying, please restore the bill 
that you introduced last year in the assembly for which you staked your chair if you present that bill if you bring back that bill of 2014 we will support this 100 percent we will congratulate the government we will join this support this particular activity and if the central government opposes that bill we shall join hands with Arvind Kejriwal in launching an agitation against the central government. That's all that we want. Chan Lokpal is sacred to us. The country needs Chan Lokpal. We need to show to the country that these great ideals can be realized in practice. We all need to come together. We are willing to do that. The Lokpal that we had dreamt of Let's all come together. I would appeal to Arvind K. Shrival. I would appeal to all the soldiers of Anna movement. Let's all join hands together. Let's remember what we promised in Ramdila Maidan. Let's make that real.